Hey guys, it's me, Lexi, and welcome back to the Vanderbilt Bachelor. So in this part, we're going to be going on like dates and stuff like that. I'm just kind of getting him more into the dating scene, sort of, but like also not dating. So yeah, we're just going to be kind of swooning over a lot of women, but right now we're just kind of making some waffles. In the last part, I like planned on recording a little bit more, but honestly, he was so tired. Like I just wanted him to get some rest. So we literally like went to sleep and then we just slept until like 5 a.m. But today is actually leisure day, which is super exciting. We get the day off and um, we can go out and do a bunch of fun stuff. So I am very excited. Um, I think we'll actually start our day off with going to the gym. Um, we're just going to go upstairs and shower and use the restroom real quick um, just so we can get that out of the way. And then I want him to... Like I said, go to the gym, which I just have to find it because this is still a very new world to me. Um, where is she? The gym, the gym, the gym. Is there a gym? Hello? Am I going crazy? Where's the gym at? Oh, <laughs> I am going crazy. It's right here. Okay, so yeah, we're going to go to the Golden Gym, and we're going to get a little bit of an early morning workout in so we can kind of get pumped for the rest of the day. I think we'll maybe hang out with Mabel, um, hopefully Rosalind, though, because she's kind of like this, like, weirdo who, like, won't hang out with us, right? But, like, also, he's very much into pursuing something that doesn't want him. That actually, actually attracts him a little bit more that she, like, rejected him. He's like, oh, my God, like, you're rejecting me? Like a frat boy? Like what? <laughs> so we're definitely going to try to pursue her again today. Um, but we're going to go upstairs, I believe. Oh my god, this gym is hideous. <laughs> oh my god, I hate it. I just don't like all of this tile. Like what is this tile? I hate it. Anyway. Yeah, we're just going to go pump some iron. Iron. Okay, just kidding, actually, because there's people on it. So we're just going to go work out on the treadmill. It's fine. You don't have to get up. I just want him to improve his athletic skill, like, once, maybe, if he can. Um, he's actually level four in athletic right now. I'm going to tell you guys this is skills because I didn't do that last episode. But he's level four athletic, level seven charisma, level five guitar, level two handiness, level four logic, and level three gambling. He does like to dabble in that a little bit. I actually need to play somewhere where there's a little bit of gambling. He mostly did that in college just to try to get his funds up because obviously there wasn't many options for him. Um, but we're just going to do this for a little bit that I think we're going to invite out Miss Roslyn. I kind of want to I don't know. Who else is there that we can hang out with? Um, Women-wise. Um, there's a certain woman that I am... I think it's this one. Persephone? It is Persephone. Ooh! Uh, pool party! Absolutely, I will be there. That's in an hour. So, um, we'll probably just do this for another hour, and then we'll go to that party. And hopefully there's some cool people there. Um, we'll see, though. <laughs> Okay, I think it's actually going on right now. Yeah. All right, let's go attend his party. Um, hopefully it's a good one. I'm not like super boring, but we'll see. Oh my God, he's so sexy. I love his name too, Enzo. Like, oh my God, Vampire Diaries. <laughs> I love Enzo and Vampire Diaries. He's so hot. All right. We made it to the pool party where there's literally no pool. What? Samantha's here again. Let's go talk to her a little bit. Um, I feel like she's just, like, not happy with us. Let's go, like, ask her about her career. Like, what are you doing with yourself now? And I ask her a sign. So, when she was in college, she was very... She, Samantha is a pick-me girl. She's, like, the type of girl that would be like, these are my real lashes and then get fake or like lash extensions and like wear no makeup but we'll be wearing like foundation and concealer and like highlight and stuff like that and she's like uh I'm gonna go to the gym and like pump like 10 pounds or whatever you know what I mean and like try to get some wiener out of it or something she's like that kind of girl she's very much of a picky girl and um she's actually way less 
successful than Enzo and it kind of makes her so mad because she really wanted to like be something I want to buy them a juice cake I'm sorry I like keep burping oh my god I don't know why I'm a little bit of a burpy girl today okay let's buy them a juice kegger um and place it down somewhere why do you you don't even need a crib okay you don't need a crib you literally are a single sim i'm pretty sure so <laughs> i'm like pretty sure so let's buy a juice keg and then let's do it with samantha um and maybe try to spoon her because there's really nobody else here that i even want to talk to uh because they're all ugly so <laughs> we could have tried it um get her to get us drunk and stuff like that because why not like we're at a freaking pool party right and it'll be a lot of fun and um maybe we can take okay i was gonna say oh look at her putting her hand on his back like oh, i'm so sorry do you want to go like to the hospital <laughs> she's like sorry god he's like gotta pump my own juice anyway um let's go ahead and discuss work with her <clears throat> I'm like, let's just do some casual speaking. Oh. There is a pool. What the hell is this? <gasps> Are you fucking kidding me? What is this? Is this a freaking pool to you? <laughs> that is so funny to me. It's only a 4x4. Four four. <laughs> is it even a 4x4? Four four? It's a 2x2. Two two. Oh my god. Ooh, become a business partner. That's a really good idea, actually. Um, I want him to get into that, but I want to get our funds up a little bit. Um, but we're just going to talk to her for a little bit and, like, just ask her about how she's been. Maybe tell her she looks really good. Like, I really love the lip filler you've been getting clean. Like, keep doing it. But, like, also don't keep doing it because your lips are already, like, plenty. I want to. I just want to see how she's been doing it. Oh my God, Brandy and Skip broke are also in the save, which, oh my God, I'm so excited for. But let's go ahead and compliment her personality as well, and give her a little bit of a flirt. Just kind of boost her ego a little bit and get her thinking like, oh my God, like he actually wants me again. When in reality we don't. We just want to give her this false hope that we do want her, just to get revenge and. Hopefully, she'll realize this eventually. But let's go ahead and um, dip kiss. Where'd that go? I want to dip kiss her. Oh, my God. Okay. Where'd that go? Hold on. We can't even kiss her? Okay, can we blow her a kiss? Oh, yeah. She likes that. Let's go, um, woohoo with Miss Samantha, um, and <clears throat> get, you know, get it going. Like, why not? Um, you know, ex-girlfriends just kind of, like, know what's up, right? <laughs> he's also feeling a little bit drunk right now. He's a, he's a bit juiced, okay? So, Samantha's also the kind of girl that's, like, oh, my God, women that wear, like, too much revealing clothes are just, like, basically asking for, like, Ben to talk to them, right? But she does, so she doesn't wear, like, too much revealing clothes when she's just, like, in her everyday wear. But in her sleepwear, it's a whole nother Samantha. Whole nother Samantha. She's a little bit of a crazy lady. Uh, but we're going to go use the restroom because uh, we don't want to use TI. Go piss, girl. Go piss, girl. And then we're going to, um, oh, I have to go now. I think it's time you left also. Okay, so we, I guess we have to go home, but I really don't want to go home. Honestly, I kind of want to invite out <laughs> Rosalyn um, again because, you know, we really like her actually kind of. Um, and we kind of just want to get to know her a little bit more. Like, why are you so mysterious, queen? So we're going to invite her out to this bar and see if she wants to hang out there for a little bit and um, get to know each other a little bit more. So, we're going to go there real quick. What's this? Feeling slightly unlucky. 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 Okay. Whatever. Don't let them get to your head, King. <laughs> also, our relationship is, like, horrible with our boss now. But we literally don't have a boss. Okay. 
Um, but let's go order a drink. We're gonna go order whatever that fucking word is, and then Rosalind's here actually. So let's go ahead and change her outfit because I'm not gonna look at her in this shit. So hey girl, how's it going? Let's go ahead and give her a little hug, a little amorous hug, and compliment her appearance and her personality. And, oh, trait incompatible. What? Oh, it's fine though. It's fine though. <laughs> okay. And then we're going to flirt with her. <clears throat> Excuse me. And, um, blow her a kiss. I want to also try to kiss her for the first time. So we'll see how she takes it. He wants to invite Rosalind over. Which I would like to tonight. Um, but we do have work in the morning, so we need to keep that in mind. Um, so we're actually going to go use the restroom. And then uh, I just kind of want to order some food. Actually, what if we, like, went out and got food? Like, how close is the... Oh, literally right across the street. Let's go eat there with our date. And then we're going to invite her over for some, like, after activities, if you will. Um, because you just can never have enough. Like, he's a man. You know, what can you expect? Um, yeah. So, let's go ahead and... I'm thinking of leaving soon. Girl, you right here. We're going to eat dinner, and then I will be back with you guys when we're at our house. Okay, guys. So, we're home, and I'm actually going to have him risky woohoo with Rosalind. There's only a 10% chance that she'll get pregnant, but I do want to kind of risk it, to be honest with you, just because, like... It's Rosalind. Like, he's not too worried about it. You know what I mean? Like, she's very sexy. So, um, has to behave. Girl, calm down. I need to go home now. Bye. Oh, my God. Stop. Rosalind. <laughs> Never mind. I guess we're just going to go to sleep. Oh, my God. I'm so in pain right now. What the hell? You literally told her to do it. And also, like, you guys are pretty much besties. Like, why does it matter? Why does it matter? Anyways, I'll pick up in the morning. <laughs> okay, guys. So, we are just finishing up with work. And we're actually going to go introduce ourselves to Niccolo because he's a very successful businessman. Um, and I did place him. <laughs> but he is a very successful businessman. And we just want to kind of get to know him a little bit more and kind of ask him... Like networking, essentially. Um, just kind of see what he's all about and stuff like that. So um, we are just going to talk to him just a little bit. We are awfully tired, honestly. Like, his energy is pretty low, considering. Um, <clears throat> but he's honestly like a drug dealer. Like, that's his whole thing. Um, he does not have his old hair. Oh, he's unemployed. Um, it's fine. I'm going to give him a career <laughs> in the business career choose job um business and then uh let's choose his level real quick because um that's also really important because like yeah he's gonna be level 10 okay there we go <laughs> anyway so now he's very much of a successful man <laughs> Um, oh, he doesn't really like us that much, to be honest with you. Like, he's kind of annoyed with us constantly. You know what? It's fine. We'll, we'll tell him a joke and it'll all be great. Let's enthuse about work. Maybe we should go on a real date sometime. Sure. Okay, so we're friends with him, um, which is really cool. Um, I do want to become a business partner somewhere. Um... Maybe here. Oh, no, we can't. What? Where can we become a business partner? $20,000 for a partnership? Oh, my fucking God. Oh, God. What about here? $18,000. Oh, my God. What the hell? Oh, God, it's so expensive. Um... Let's go to a concert with, um, Rosalind real quick 
and um, just kind of hang out with her for a little bit. You know, why not? <clears throat> oh, he plays guitar. Yeah, they're like besties immediately. They're besties. Um, <clears throat> where the hell's Rosalind? I don't know where she is. We're waiting on her right now, apparently. Oh, is she in here? No. Oh, there she is. Okay, cool. So we're gonna... <laughs> okay. Let's go to the fucking concert with her. Ro Roslyn, let's go. Okay, so we just really don't want to go to this concert, I guess. What the fuck? Let's go ahead and flirt with her, and let's take her out to a nice dinner. Um, uh, let's go ahead and eat with Roslyn here real quick, just so we can, like... Oh, she wants to hold our hands. Too bad. That's too romantic for us. But yeah, we're going to go eat dinner here with Rosalind, um, just to kind of take her out and, like, give her false promises. Because, yeah, that's what they do. That's what Sagittarius to men do. And then I think after that, we'll honestly go home and get go to sleep, trying to get, like, a good night's rest. I want to freaking put some gambling machines somewhere to try to, like, improve our gambling a little bit more and also just, like, take advantage of that. Probably, like, this saloon right here. I feel like it'd be most fitting right there. <clears throat> also, um, our ex lives right here, which is really close to our house, um, on purpose. I did that on purpose, so... Yeah, but tomorrow's Saturday, honestly, I'm going to, like, treat his energy a little bit, just a little bit, um, because I kind of want to go to, like, a bar or something after this, um, I don't know if I want to take Roslyn, <clears throat> I kind of just want to go, like, who's here, ice cream, let's, like, check out who's here, literally nobody, okay, um, what if we, like, threw a party there, Like, what if we did? Hmm. Interesting, right? <clears throat> At 12 a.m., we throw a party, because why not? So let's invite the brogues, because, you know, they're fun. And then invite everybody we're friends with, pretty much, um, that we give a shit about. So we, okay, we gotta, like, pick and choose who we want. So we're gonna invite Roslyn here, because I feel like this is more her scene, <clears throat> instead of, Mabel because I don't want them to fight. I don't want them to fight. So they're going to go together, just him and Rosalind, and then we're going to invite Samantha as well, just to make her freaking mad. <gasps> it's too early! Oh my god! Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go to the Irish Green with these two, right? And then we're going to invite Sims over. Um, hold on. I can do this with, like, in Ross, so that way I don't have to actually invite them over. There's a way. Invite over. Age. Young adult. Broke. Broke. Um... Just in case she doesn't come. And then Flora. Um, okay. There we go. Okay, I invited a bunch of Sims over, so hopefully it'll get kind of full. Pretty quickly here, there's Diana, actually, already. There's Niccolo. Roslyn looking sexy! Sorry, I hiccuped in the middle of that. I literally just fucking hiccuped. Um, Flora is honestly, like, um... She's rich. Oh! God, you're in my freaking... Where's everybody going? Come here! No. Come here. I'm going to lose it. Dia is constantly having something in her fucking hand. I don't get it. Let's go ask her about her career, I guess. We're going to talk to her. And then um, ask her about her day. Her degree. Who's this? Skip. 
This bitch is leaving too. Oh my god, you guys are so boring. It's literally Friday night. Where are you guys going? Like, come get some drinks and stuff. Uh, let's give her a little wink. And then we'll... Oh, she has a degree in business. <laughs> that is so funny. That is so funny that you mentioned that. Let's ask her if she's single and ask her sign real quick. And then I think we're going to go order a drink. Um, <clears throat> just for funsies. She's cancer. Oh, she's emotional. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love cancers. I'm sorry. Okay. But honestly, I think after this drink, we might go home. Like, there's literally no one here. His name's Dexter. That's my cat's name. Yeah, there's, like, nobody here. Oh, my God. It's so annoying because this bar is so cute. I was, like, so excited um, for everybody to come here. But, yeah, honestly, I think we're just going to go home and, like, try to get some good sleep tonight because he's kind of living off, like, four hours of sleep every single day and, like, just vibing. But, yeah, we're going to go home. <laughs> and we'll take a little shower and go to sleep. And then um, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this part here, though, you guys. I hope you all enjoyed it very, very much. I love you guys so much. I'm very excited to continue on with this family. Leave me some, like, suggestions that you want for drama um, because I feel like just having woo with multiple women at once is not enough. So we'll see if we can't get something going on. <clears throat> Sorry for my voice. I need to cough, but, like, nothing is happening when I cough. So it's, like, counterproductive. But anyway, leave me some suggestions as to what you guys would like to see with him because I am completely open to absolutely literally anything. I've never really played with a man to be honest with you. So, um, I'm absolutely down to listen to what you guys have to say. And then, um, this will be the last part before next week. Um, while I'm at trial, probably unless I record some tomorrow, but we'll see. Regardless, I might upload twice tomorrow. Anyway, I love you guys and I'll see you all next time. Bye everybody.